And it crashes. Shit, did OBS actually crash? No, it didn't. There it goes. Hey, we're live. Hey, guys. I am super tired. I've had a long goddamn day. It's very late at night. And I would just like to sleep. But I challenged myself to put something out every single day. So, right now, we're going to play the raccoon who lost their shape. This is a game by Film Cow. And if you don't know who Film Cow is, you need to know who Film Cow is. He's kind of important because he made this game. Uh, also, that sound that you hear in the background, that's my air conditioner. I've decided to not turn it off. I don't want to die. I want to I wanna die from heat. Anyway, let's play this game. This game's... Oh, shit. This game has got a fucking kick-ass beat. Man, this, just listen to it for a minute. You like that song, Tyler? Tyler probably can't hear it. Oh, hi, stream. Oh, hi, big boy. I'm going to drop the volume down a little bit. Just, uh, eh, keep it right about there. That, that, that'll that be good. I have no idea what the stream sounds like, so. All right. Let's go. People come in many different shapes. I'm gonna lower the volume a little bit so I can fucking hear. Yeah, gaming stream. The AC is imperceptible in comparison to you. That's that's good to know. I don't want to die of heat. People come in many different shapes. Literal shapes. Shapes with faces on them. Although he looks kind of like a tired, sad, sort of depressed raccoon. Literal shapes. Shapes with faces on them. Shape people. Many years ago, I discovered I had an ability. The ability to contact shape people who had died. Their souls trapped forever in the shape person death realm. I'm a medium between the world of the living and the dead, but only for shape people. People who are literally large, flat, conscious shapes with faces on them and nothing else. This is my story. So you control a little raccoon. Run around. Uh, let's see. A and D is back and back. Up is jump. Down is get down. And I guess E is use. Q. Space. Oh. I should talk with my next client before going into the summoning room. I'm an adult. And I can make my own choices. And this is my choice. Okay. I have no one to call. And no one calls me. Why do I even have a phone in here? I guess to order food. That's usually too expensive, though. This phone serves, serves no purpose other than to taunt me. Can I leave? I still have work to do. I can't leave yet. I mean, I could leave. I want to leave. But, I'm not going to leave. It would be so easy to just 
walk out the door. So easy. All right, so I guess I gotta call the shape client. This button sends in my next client via the state-funded shape people tube system. <laughs> He's a hangover raccoon up for 72 hours. What, Ty? Tyler, what? Tyler, what? Do you want to here, Tyler? Do you want to get on the chair? You want to get on the chair? Come on, come here. No, oh, he want he he wants he wants me to go to bed. I can't go to bed. I'm tired. I need. I seriously just got done fucking working and and whatever. All right. It's a network of tubes that shape people travel through to get to places because they do not have arms or legs. They are just shapes. Shall I press the button? Press the button. Boop, I pressed it. Oh god. Okay. Hello, I'm a pentagram. Pentagon. Pentagons have five sides and five corners. Yeah, I know what a pentagon is. I do not think do not think for a single moment that your knowledge of shapes impresses me. <laughs> I am here because I need you to contact my beloved recently dead friend who is a circle. Yes, you heard me. A circle. You might wonder how someone with such an abundance of sides could be friends with someone who had none. It was a lot of work, but the circle finally understood the true superiority of sides and angles. And thus, they also came to understand the truth of their own inferior shape. You sound like a terrible friend. I would not expect you to understand. You, too, lack sides and manners. The reason I need to contact my dead sideless friend is because of a locked door I have discovered hidden behind a bookshelf in an old library. I would like you to ask where this door might be. Can you do that for me? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Job's a job. Well, yes, we all have our roles. <laughs> and your role right now is to serve me. I have brought with me personal items, a book... Uh, yeah. All right, so we got the personal item, and he wants us to find the key. Hi, Jojo. I'm really fucking tired. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Okay. This is my summoning altar. I use it to summon the ghosts of shape people. Shape people are the only ones who seem to turn into ghosts when they die. Sometimes I worry that it's because non-shape people like myself have no soul. I think a lot about my own death. Shall I summon the dead shape person? Yeah. Oh, fuck. You guys have to hear this. <laughs> hey, Weasel, how are you doing? I'm being tired. Tyler, what the fuck? Tyler wants me to go to bed. Alright, so we got a floating dead shape person. Here we go. Hello, I'm a circle. I'm sure you knew that. I wasn't expecting to be summoning today. How interesting. May I help you with something? Hired, a friend of you hired to summon you. They found a locked door in your old library and would like to know the location of the key. Which friend might you be referring to? A pentagon. Haha. -ha. 
Ha 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 ha. Ah, uh, yes, my friend. Did they tell you about the glory of angles and sides? Did they explain in great detail the perfection of their holy pentagon form? Please, tell them the key is hidden behind an old wall clock that hangs on the other side of the library. Do you know what's behind the locked door? A canister of toxic gas! Oh, shit! Tell the Pentagon that great treasures are hidden inside the room, and it's theirs for the taking. Ha! Thank you for your information. Oh, there's one more thing. Have you happened upon any crescents during your time in the realm of the dead? No, not that I remember. Crescents are fairly rare as Shea people go. I'm sure I would recall seeing them. Ah, well, thank you anyway. Ah, uh, shit. I love that door sound. Kitty commands you to sleep. He can plot rebellion in private. Tyler, come here. Come here. Tyler. Tyler. Come here. Come here, buddy. Come ah. He wants me to do some, some goddamn shit. Have you discovered the location of the key? I'm going to tell him where it is. I know of that clock. Thank you. I shall submit payment for your fee through the Shape Network payment system. Good day. Oh, fuck. I didn't tell him about the goddamn gas. I could have just slept in my office. I think that I still have some ramen at home. If I get home and I don't have any ramen left, I'm going to be all torn up. I'm not... I'm going to be all torn up about it. There was no ramen. All right. Sigh. This is this isn't even a good photo, but it's the only one I have left. I guess we're trying to contact that that guy right there. Ah. Uh. Are you sure you want a repeat of the other day with Tyler? You sound out of your gourd when you're tired. Well, you know, I'm I'm some kind of weasel. You see, I, I, I feel a certain affinity with raccoons. After all, weasels and raccoons are very similar, both being omnivorous mammals. So many similarities. Um, let's see. What else can I say while I'm on, like, extremely low power? I'm not even kidding. I may be going off of, like, 3 volts. 1.5 volts. I am very fucking efficient, but that is still a very small amount of power. What the fuck am I doing? All right, let's let's get another guy and let's get another shape person. Time for another case, I suppose. All I need to do is push that button. That's all I need to do. Shall I push the button? And fuck it, don't. I don't have to press the button. I can do anything I want today. Anything I want. Yeah. Go outside. I'm going to do it. I'm going to leave. Any second now. God damn it. Yes. Boop. Ah, square. Yes, hello, I'm a square. Four points, four equal sides. Very easy to remember. All right. What a lovely office you have. I hate my office, and I also hate my life. Oh, dear. I'm very sorry to hear that. Very sorry, indeed. I do hope that things get better for you. I know nothing about you, but you seem like a reasonable sort. The reason I am in need of your services is that I very much want to send a message to a dear departed rectangle. We are very similar in many ways, as you can imagine. Yes. Yes, I can. Hey, why, uh... Push the button, Frank. But not just in shape, in spirit as well. Okay, so very good friends indeed. What message do you want? Oh, yes, the message. 
I would like you to tell the rectangle, tell them that I'm very, that I'm very dearly, I think very dearly of them. Okay, I'll let them know. Wonderful. Uh, personal item. A letter I wrote them many years ago. Put it on, all right. They wrapped a bow around the frame, so this guy's very fucking upset. Very, very, thought very dearly of this rectangle. Thank you. This should work. I'll let you know when the summoning is complete. I am so nervous. Since I am square, I am nervous as well. Nervous that I might actually fall asleep and live stream me sleeping. That would be... Let me scroll down here real quick. Is there a way to save? Uh, there is no way to save. I want to fucking save. Guess I have to keep going. There we go. Come on. Alright, let's do the summoning. Here we go. Turn up the volume on here. Come on, do it. Yep. Summon it. Fun. Fun on some kind of giant casserole. Tarantula. Squid people. Tyler, what are you doing? Tyler. Tyler, come here. Come here. Come here, buddy. Ah. Oh, don't act like that, you little... Come here. Tyler. Come on. Ah. Why are you being a little goddamn bastard? Goddamn bastard. Wow, I have been summoned. How thrilling. How wonderful to be summoned. I have, you brought me, why have you brought me back into the world of the living? A friend of yours hired to give me a message. A friend? Oh my. Was it my square friend? <laughs> yes, it was your square friend. Oh my god, I am so excited. What was the message? They wanted you to know that they still think very dearly of you. Oh my god, yes. Oh yes, hooray. What the fuck? You can reply. Can you reply to me? I want you to tell them I continue to think dearly of them as well. Um, sure. I'll go tell them now. I'll tell them. I'm starting to sound a bit Dan Harmonish right now. Did you tell them? What did they say? I'm so nervous to hear. They continue to think very... That is amazing news! What, I didn't have a, uh, an option to lie to them? Can you do... Can you ask one more message from me? Yeah, sure. Can you tell them... That I am certain that we... Will be dear to each other forever. Can you tell them that for me? Um... Yeah. Thank you so much for your help. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Oh wow, hello again. Yes. They want to get shape married to you. <laughs> oh fuck. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh my god, what? That is amazing news. I am so happy. Tell them I said yes. Oh my god, sure, will do. Oh, uh, one last thing. Do you know any crescents in the realm of the dead? Crescents? No, I don't think so. Ah, nuts. Just looking for someone who I... Never mind. Alright, cool. How do they react? I must know. They want to get shape married to you. What? This is incredible. I cannot believe my good fortune. I must begin preparations. Oh, what wonderful... But they're dead, though. So how's that going to work? Thank, thank you so much for all your help, friend. 
I will send your payment through the network. You've been invited to the wedding. Everything is pain. I find no satisfaction in my work anymore. Tell me about it, dude. Fuck. Not, not in this. In the other job. I have many, many jobs. Uh, one of which is I... Error. Reloading. Uh, I, sorry, I had to re reboot the OS there real quick. Okay, here we go. Back. Although, I'm not sure if I ever really did. Oh, yeah, tell me about it. It pays the bills, though. Hey, at least you have one job that pays the bills. More often than not, it does not pay the bills, though. So here we are, back again. Don't fall asleep, Weasel. I'm not falling asleep. Error, reloading. Shit. I had to fucking reboot my OS again. <laughs> God damn. Ah, fuck. The world just keeps spinning over and over again. Oh boy. Shall I press the button? Yes! Do it! Oops! Missed it! <laughs> oh, fuck! This guy's drunk. Oh, God. Oh, God. What the fuck is that? It's a triangle, but it looks like it's got some kind of Satan fork in it. Hey, I'm a triangle. Whatever. <laughs> Not a big deal. Who cares? You a summoner? Yeah, I'm, I'm a summoner. Good. Went to the right places. They were both in the wrong place. You're hard to find. If someone has the wrong address, you should look into that. But yeah, I need you to summon someone. A star. Very pointy star. You know what a star is, right? Yeah, I know what a star is. All right, good. Here's the thing of theirs. You need this thing, right? Some sort of wallet, I think. It's just a regular wallet. I mean, let me try and do this in, like, a Meeseeks thing. Like, ooh, we, you know what? What I'm spending a lot of time looking at, it doesn't actually look that weird. Maybe I, I just, I need to get you seeing it. So, yeah, here's their wallet. Here you go. Uh, yeah. Does it have any money in it? Not anymore. <laughs> Summon them and tell them the triangle says they're sorry. I wish I had, like, bigger words or whatever, but I don't think it matters. <laughs> sorry should be good enough. <laughs> Let me know when it's all done, okay? All right. Why am I waiting randomly to see copper cab just start raging <laughs> fuck <laughs> that dude this hey Lazel, did you end up saving your friendship with that literary no i had never contacted him all right here we go doing this ritual feels exactly what you would expect touching death to feel you've got some problems it's not a great feeling. Shall I summon the dead shape person? Yeah. Ah, oh, that's fucking fun. Here we go. Oh, that felt very weird. You're a raccoon, hello. I've heard of these summoning things. I wouldn't expect one to happen to me. So what can I help you with? I was hired by a triangle to summon you and let you know that they're sorry. Are you serious? They're sorry? They murdered me. Oh, fuck. 
Do we have? To, are we gonna have to fight this thing or whatever? What time is it? Jesus Christ! All right, here we go. They. Shit. Okay, so that triangle's a fucking murderer. So, uh, I wonder if I'm gonna have to fight him. You around here, Tyler? Damn cat. Yeah, okay, so I didn't know that. Wait a minute, they gave you personal item, right? They gave me this, uh, wallet. Holy shit. Okay, so he gave... That's the wallet they stole when they killed me. Fuck. How'd they... I'd like to know what a shape person wallet looks like. I don't think they got no clothes. They killed me for that wallet. My perfect star face got stabbed for that thing. The gall. The absolute gall. Ah, uh, shit. Well, uh... That's the extent of the summoning. They don't have any other messages for you. Sorry about all this. Unbelievable. Tell them I hope their angles get ripped off. Tell them I hope someone sandpapers away their terrible shape face. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Hey, one last thing. You see any crescents? No. God damn it. Whoa. Okay, so this star is pretty pissed. Uh, so... I'm kind of wondering how this is going to go down. Let me check the controls here. Uh, nothing about controls. Okay, uh... <coughs> Alright. I don't... I hope there's... I don't think there's combat. What did they tell you? Um, they had some very harsh words for you. Figured as much. The past is in the past, though. Can't dwell on old mistakes. Uh, dude, you fucking stabbed them in the face. I have to put this behind me now. Thanks for your help, or whatever. Okay. Here's some cash on your desk later. I've been doing this for years, and I've only met three or four shape ghosts who have seen a crescent. It always it seems to have been the wrong crescent. I'm not sure why I keep doing this. Because you have no other monetizable skills. That hit too fucking close to home. Just me, or is the office darker? On the uh, acid trip. He's cheap, also, Weasel. Vine sauce? Who's Vine sauce? Another day, another button. Let's press ourselves some buttons. What a life. Yep. Let's do it. Rejoice. The fuck? It's a green hexagon. I'm gonna get slightly more comfortable here. I'm gonna lay down a little bit. There we go. Now I look like a really big fat asshole fucking lunatic. Here we go. Six sides, six points. I'm a hexagon, and I have arrived. Okay. You must be the summoner. I can tell, because I was looking at a photograph of you. I realize you're probably nervous dealing with the shape of such mathematical elegance. Is there anything I can do to make you more comfortable? Uh, I think I'll manage. Yes, I'm sure that you will. Before we begin, a very important query. Can you summon any shape? For instance, 
Can you summon shapes that have even more sides and points than I do? Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't matter how many sides or whatever they got. I can even summon shapes with no sides. All I need is an item that they owned and interacted with while they were alive. Ah, uh, yes, I do have such an item. It's a cross. Twelve sides, twelve points. Perfection. A chill flows through me just thinking about them and their glory. I must admit, I'm worried. <coughs> I'm a ghastly shape in comparison, an abomination. These, these shape people are so fucking weird. He's a Twitch streamer. He streams strange and weird crappy games on Sunday. Except this Sunday. He's away. Well. Yeah. Um. What's so. <coughs> what's so special about your fucking points? It's difficult to explain to a non-shape. There's a mathematical importance that runs through our being. Anyway, here's the item you require. It's a rose. All right. They were a singer. Okay, so it's a singer. Their music lifted me out of the darkest period of my life, and I owe them everything. I just want them to know. All right. You are a shape with a face. Y yes, I am. Please let me know when you have completed the summoning. <laughs> Here we go. Time to laugh in the face of shape death. Shall I summon the next dead shape person? Yes. Huh. It's really more of an X. But yeah, I guess it's a cross. I guess a cross is a shape. Oh, hey! It's you! Wow, it's been almost a year. Same coat, huh? <coughs> hey, cross. How have things been in death? Uh, just sort of drama. My trio split up. I'm looking into a new group to sing with. Oh, and I was briefly dating a Deca Decagon. You can imagine how that went. They managed three dates before bringing up the perfection of eight gone, ten gons all over oh, the other shapes. Yeah, speaking of which, just tell your client what you always tell them. The cross says that you are two are a shape worthy of dignity. Did you know that I still get summoned at least once a week for this kind of thing? It's sweet. Cause, but it's also really depressing. Yeah, I like this. <laughs> good to break up the monotony of murder victims. Well, thanks for your help. It was good to see you again. Sorry if I interrupted any. Nah, nothing going on today. Oh, hey, I ran into a crescent a month or two ago, but it wasn't the one you knew. Just wanting you to know that I'm still keeping an eye out. Thanks, Cross. I appreciate it. No problem, Raccoon. See you around. Shit. Did you summon the cross? Did they give them a message? Yeah, I wanted me to tell you that you are a shape worthy of dignity. How extraordinary. The shape of so many sides points saying that it. It means so much. Thank you for your help. I will send your payment right away through the network, of course. <coughs> I wonder what my life would be like if the fire had never happened. All right, so we're le we're learning a little more. If a, in a single night it hadn't consumed both the life of my crescent and any item that would have let me contact him in the death realm. No use thinking about these things, and yet I cannot stop. I should treat myself to a pizza. The pizza place was already closed. It's Sunday. Hey, it is Sunday, isn't it? I'm a... I need a Xanax. 
Jared Milton. Jared Milton. Fathom dot itch. Uh, need more tea or something. Or caffeine. Tyler. Tyler, do you wanna you wanna come on? Come on, get up on the chair. Do the chair thing. I want him I want him to get on the chair. He likes getting on the chair. Hi Lord. Come here. Come here. I want you. Oh. There you go. What? What? Uh, all right, go on. Go on, get on the back of the chair. Hang out. <coughs> Hang out with me, cat. Hang out with me. Ah, oh, cat. Yeah, help me. Help me stay awake here. Nah, no, come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, stay on the chair, man. Come on, man. Stay on the chair, man. When was the last time I went outside? Look at this. Look at this depressed raccoon. Tyler. Tyler, come on. There you go. Yeah, yeah, man. Just chill out. Chill out, dog. Yeah. <laughs> chill out, dog. My cat. Probably not. Hasn't been there for a while. Shall I press the button? Yes. Did you jump? Let's see. I have pressed the button. No turning back now. Uh, a rhombus. Who's there? Why, it's me. A parallelogram. <laughs> oh, God. All right, so... Yeah, I am, I am way fucking tired. I won't hurt you, fam. <laughs> Jonesy was here a minute ago, but much like Tyler, he left after inhaling his salmon fortin. Tyler. Tyler, say hi. Say hi to them, man. Say hi to them, man. Goddamn cat. Tyler just wants to show you his ass. Parallelogram who? A quadril... A, a quadratic... A qua, uh, quadratial... Quadradial, radical, quadradial, quad, quadrilateral, bleh. I probably haven't said that word in more than a decade, okay? With two pairs of parallel sides. That was a joke, but it's not a joke. Nice to meet you, parallelogram. Nice to meet you too. Uh, yeah, I'm. You may be wondering why I said meat in a strange way. It's because I actually said meat on account of you being a flesh being. Parallelograms are not usually comedians, but I know many jokes. Would you like to hear another joke? No, but okay. What shapes are good at catching people? Trapezoids. Uh. Please tell me this character fucking dies an oozing diarrhea death. That was a joke is usually is actually extremely offensive which is why i would not recommend repeating it hey buddy hey buddy look look over there yeah good buddy good buddy yeah oh. Oh. we should get down to business yes down to business please Okay, find my heart. I don't mean an organ. Okay, so the shape person is 
All right, understood, understood. Are you saying under? Oh God, fuck this guy. I don't care anything else he says. I hate the fucking jokes. This should work. Do you have a message you'd like me to tell them? I would like you to let them know that I'm still telling jokes every single day and every married day. What? Also, please ask them if they have learned any good jokes since they have been dead. I'm dying to know. Sure, was there something else? That's all. Thank you for your help. Oh no, I do not know any raccoon jokes. I will think of a raccoon joke next time. Fucking die of an oozing yellow diarrhea death. You okay? I'm very tired. I'm extremely tired. It's been a very long day. A very, very long fucking day. And I think maybe I should just go to bed. But here we go. I wish the candles in this room were scented. Shaped ghosts smell like sweaty crocodiles. Shall I summon the dead thing? Uh, yeah. Ring ding. What? You getting uncomfortable or what, Tybor? All right, so here we go. Here's a heart thing. What happened? Oh, I've been summoned. Neat. How can I help? Uh, have you been hired? I've been hired by a parallelogram to give you a message. Oh. Did you hear some uh, hilarious jokes? <coughs> yeah, you could say that. <clears throat> they mean well. They have a hard time communicating with people. And jokes help out with that. The jokes are terrible, but it helps them think about what they're trying to say. I wish I could have done more to help them, but then I went and died. <coughs> How are they doing? They wanted you to know that they're still telling jokes every day. Actually, their exact wording was every single day and every married day. Believe it or not, their jokes have gotten better since I saw them. I'm really glad to hear they're still talking to people. I've been worried. They're also dying to know if you've learned any jokes since you died. Oh, let's see. Uh, what did the square say to the circle? Not to take sides, but you're pretty pointless. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, that physically hurt. The last animation had stars shooting out of the raccoon's hands. <laughs> Tybor. Tylor, Tybor. Tynor, Tibble, Tinar, Cat, Varen, Blar, Smoblin, Yagibod, Yaradiroch, sometimes Gwabath, sometimes Yishavon, Yithwabianan, sometimes fucking garbage person. So, like, hey, fucking garbage person, you want some food? <laughs> Uh, you take all the abuse. It's cool that he doesn't have a language center. Doesn't really know what the hell I'm saying. Tyler. Tyler, look at me. Right, so this is getting pointless. <laughs> Here we go. Sure, they'll love that. Alright. Can you also tell them I'm happy that they're still telling jokes and I miss hearing them. Will do. Oh, one last thing. Have you seen a crescent? Crescents? Just one. Why? Do you know how long ago they died? Do you know if it was in a house fire? Oh, um, sorry. I didn't know how they died. I know it was a while ago, like a hundred years or so. Wow. Okay. Oh, yeah, that wouldn't be the crescent I'm looking for then. Thanks. No problem. This is going on. What is black and white and red? Um, I don't want to know, do I? A raccoon book.
I, I... <laughs> that heart looks like Elijah Wood. Huh. Because it's black and white. All right. Please go away. That's a good one. Art wants you to know they're happy and they're missing you. Telling jokes. And then I will continue telling jokes after that because life continues after death for shapes. Oh, hey, they have a new joke for you. Then I... You got it. You're the joke master. Thank you for all your help. I must sail away. See you later. Oh, God. Go. Go. Fuck. I got into this type of work to find them. The Crescent. Now I do it because I don't know what else to do. I'm not even sure what to do if I found them. I need to get some food. Did I eat today? Uh, someone left something outside my office door. It was a muffin basket from the parallelogram. Oh, well that was, that was nice of them. As this Rackham seems like it is just waiting you know, Sam, it might explain. <laughs> I... Alright, here we go. Keep going. What would, ha what would happen if I sent myself through the shape tube? I wish there were raccoon tubes. Shall I press the button? Yeah. Press it. Ah, oh, shit. It's another one. Hello, I am a diamond. Please do not call me a rhombus. The naming of shapes is very important. I agree. Diamond. All right. Thank you. Ethical question first. Is it unethical to someone to contact someone I didn't get along with at all? A shape that may not wish to hear from me. Yeah, that describes about half the summons I do. I still have my doubts. I suppose that may that by coming here I have already made my choice. Is there any much you to go it? All right. Uh, huh. The extremely valuable shape wine. It's wine made from the juice of deceased. So it's dead people juice. Okay. This particular bottle was made from their corpse. Wow. I assume the remains of their body is a personal I enough item. Uh, uh, yeah, I guess so. I apologize if this is upsetting. It is not common for certain higher class shapes. It is not uncommon that certain higher class shapes to request their bodies be turned into wine. This is endlessly fascinating. This The wine is never opened to be drank. It is to be a lasting reminder of their elegance and superiority. It all comes back down to fucking superiority. Was there a message you wanted me to give the diamond? Oh, yes. Well, sort of. I was their child. They didn't think me a worthy member of their family. I just wanted them to know. I would like them to know if their opinion has changed. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, that, that's weird. I could finish in time to see the sun setting. Or maybe I'll lay on the ground for a while after my client leaves. Shall I summon the dead shape? Yep. What do I owe the honor of this intrusion? I have been summoned to you. I have no diamond offspring. You must speak of the rhombus. When I died, I used it as an opportunity to rid myself of all the undesirable elements that plagued my life. They are but a stranger to me now. I have nothing to say to them. Uh... 
F. Alright, yes, it was a bother. We are finished. I never want to see this disgusting world again. Well, alright. Uh, that was very quick. It's okay. You don't need to give me the details. I can imagine what they said. Sorry, Diamond. I needed some sort of closure. Now I have it. They're ridiculous, and my life is better without them. Yeah, they are. Thank you for your help. I will send your payment through the network. Good day. When I left the office that night, I noticed bottles worth of shape wine poured out onto the street. A bottle's worth of shape wine. <coughs> That's going to smell really bad for days. Oh boy, did it ever. Great, the raccoon starts stars. Don't you laugh, that shape's being fed another shape. Soylent green. Here we go. Another case. Yes, I can do it. I can function as a productive citizen today. Shall I press the button? Yep. Beep boop, another button will be pressed. Oh shit, it's a crescent. It's a crescent. And the music has changed dramatically. Like, I don't know if you can hear it, but like... Okay. Hey, raccoon. <coughs> uh, I thought... I thought you were dead. Yeah. I didn't want you to try and find me. So I burned our house down and left without saying anything. I don't... Yeah, what the fuck? I needed a change. You were getting really boring. <coughs> so you burned the whole fucking house down? Yeah, that's what I just said. I knew I was... Y you knew I was a radical when you met me. You also knew I was an arsonist. That was one of my greatest passions. I've been searching for you for so long. Why you come back now? I just needed you to know. Needed you to know how boring I thought you I think you are. It's been really rough knowing that you don't know that. Fuck. Fuck. That Wow. Alright. Well, I know now. Great, I'm gonna jet, alright? Please don't keep looking for me. Also, I can't believe you still have that coat. Laters. Shit. We just watched this guy get fucking dumped on damn I feel bad like I feel bad I actually feel bad for this wreck for this raccoon I feel bad for this character bravo you made me feel something about pixel art this isn't really how I expected things to turn out I bet. That's going to take a while to process this. I think I'll go to the beach. Yeah, I haven't been to the beach in years. Today is a beach day, even if it rains. It did rain, but that was okay. And we're done. Well, fuck. All right. Wow. Shit. Yeah. Press F to pay respects. 
F. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it too. I'm gonna go down into the comments. F. Yeah. Damn. Well, I mean, it's perfect timing. It's like 11:36, so I feel fucking tired as shit. Who's that? Wow. Okay. Well, uh, uh, hey, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, check me out on Twitters, uh, support the Patreon, and uh, don't don't become friends with arsonists. They'll burn their your your house down if uh, if they think you're boring. Now I should know. I've burned a few houses down, but not be not because people inside were boring me, it's because they were abandoned houses. They had to be burned. For reasons. And, as always, have a good day. I'm so sorry for the people who just came in. Like, Weasel, you look like this game broke you. I was expecting a different ending. Actually, I was expecting... It's film, Cal, so I was kind of expecting a llama to come in and kill everybody. Um, but, you know. Thanks, Weasel. Hey. So, uh, I guess that's it. Um, good night. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get some sleep. Because I... I desperately need some fucking sleep. See you guys. Tyler. Tyler, I'm gonna go to bed. You got your fucking wish. Tyler, look at me. Look at me, you fucking garbage person. Tyler's a fucking garbage person. <laughs> Goddamn garbage picker. <clears throat> now the cops have everything they need to get a conviction. Night. My cat is watch you. Yay.